Okay, try focusing on charging your jump. That should get you higher. How exactly am I supposed to jump up that? Try pushing off from the wall each jump. So I just run up walls now, do I? It'd be more accurate to say you can jump up them repeatedly. Pretty much the same thing. This time I blew the buildings apart. Try making that jump. Oh, I'm liking this. Okay, now for the big test. Use your super speed to get a running start and leap to that opposite building. You gotta be fucking joking. Just try it. Fun. But we can do better. Good, because I found a race subroutine already in the city. Spot on. I think I figured out how this works. Run along the path collecting the power orbs, which should boost your new speed. Every time you hit a checkpoint, you'll be able to stay in the program a bit longer so you can reach the end. Though you probably want to avoid the firewalls along the way. Good luck. <laughs> After this gets jacked, no more. How's this race tied to the simulation? Don't know, but it seems like when you break through any checkpoints along the race, the district's reality matrix will overload a little. You lost me. It means the simulation doesn't like it, and we're able to control the area. Hey, that time it made sense. It did the first time I said it too. Love you too, Kitty. Lies. If he borrows... Am I ever... This is the worst seat. I totally want to go to the mall later.
behind you, bitch! I'm unstoppable! I drive my own! Quick, guys, me on! I think this helps! Got you now!
Spots are protected by shield generators. Getting near them will be tricky, but you'll have to shut down each one before you can take out the main hub, which of course is protected by even more Zin. So, good luck with that. Basically a giant workstation. A system like the simulation you're in probably requires constant maintenance, which is what these seem to be for. Of course not. shield generators, otherwise you'll never get to the main console. Showing some strange readings close to you. Strange. I don't know, but it isn't reading like a normal Zen. I think. 
think you can integrate your code with it. It means once you take him down, get close enough, and I think you can absorb him. my wardens underestimated you. I won't let them make the same mistake twice. Uh, that can't be good. Sail with it, Kinsey. Send me out with one of those training rooms. I think I can do that. So we're okay. Teleportation, laser vision, bone claws. Whoa. Looks like the ability to freeze people and objects with an ice blast. That sounds awesome. Let me load up a few targets from the simulation for you. Don't worry, these are safe programs. You can't die from them. Data clusters can be hidden inside walls. Use your blast to knock them out. I'll see if I can help with that. Okay, you should be able to recover from being knocked back now. Hold on, it looks like Zuniac added the shield to the warden code. I guess you pissed him off. You'll need something more powerful than a weapon, so use your superpowers to deactivate the shield for a short time. Then you can shoot him. That works pretty well, though the real thing might be a bit tougher. door that'll allow your mind to get out of the simulation and back into your body. Head toward it. Right. 
So what's the deal with the sin invasion, Kitsy? The good news is they didn't get everybody. Just a whole bunch of people. According to what I've been able to decipher, the simulation is designed to house the best and the brightest specimens from various worlds. The best and brightest from an entire planet? How big is this thing? Big. But they haven't gotten to all of Earth yet. It's locked. Wrong door. Ah, oh, cheers. But I think I'm terrible. Can you quit being a baby and just walk in? Look, lady, we're doing this in my time. If Zinyak wants a fight, we're going to bring it to him. Taking down this simulation will wreak havoc on all the Zin systems and help us locate our friends. There's plenty you can do to overload, disrupt, and generally break the whole damn thing, so let's start small. I know hacking stores seems trivial, but it's a good place for us to begin. All right, get moving. <laughs> I think it'd be best to start at. Plenty thing. Go big or go home, am I right? Okay, good point. Kinsey's job's easy. Oi, what just happened? Oops, you must have tripped the security alarm. And can I expect this every time? I think I can cut off the outside security program from the rest of the stores, so no, it shouldn't happen again. Shouldn't I really be going now? Um, no wait, don't. I want to see how their reaction protocols work. Oh, it's my pleasure getting shot at for you. Wine, wine, wine. What? Couple stress all day to sing. Looks like they're stepping up security even more. Be careful. More scene dropping in like that from above. Those are access portals. You should be able to destroy them to stop more soldiers from showing up. Right. floating robot thing. I think it's controlling the security program here. Shut. So if you catch the golden orb and shut it down, then the Zin should no longer see you as an immediate threat. Catch the golden orb. <laughs> Do I need to ride a broom for this? <laughs> uh, 
off your back now, so keep that in mind. Remember, this is only the beginning. With everything we're going to throw at Zinyak, he won't know what hit him. to platform. By changing the red platforms to blue, the power connection to this simulation will remain open. The closer you land to the center, the stronger the connection. I'm not finishing this until you tell me how you can help my friends. I know how to navigate the Zin systems and travel between them. If you can find the right simulation, I can open a gateway between that one and yours. Oh, that's real convenient. Why should I trust you? Because I have no love for the Zin, as I was once their prisoner too. I have been stuck inside the Zin simulations, creating rifts, which cause chaos for Zinya. Though the Zin inevitably shut them down. So, what will be your errand, boy? Your help ensures I am able to keep them open permanently. A benefit to us both. Can you have done this on your own? My body has long since died. I implanted my consciousness into the main simulation computer many years ago. But even though you have no body, you're still gonna help me, right? I cannot. That is, not unless you find me a physical, mobile form I can download my memory metrics into first. Uh, that sounds like a lot of work for a vague promise. Unlike humans, I keep my word and pay my debts. Besides, you know you need me 